Good evening, everyone. How the fuck are you guys doing? Um, I suppose that I could be doing better, but you guys know me. Um, you know, it, when when something happens around here on YouTube, uh, I've got a big fucking mouth, and I've got to throw in my two cents. That's just the way it is. Even when, even when I don't have a channel of my own to do that from anymore, um, which is the case tonight. Um, I've been suspended. I've received four fraudulent DMCA notices on my four most recent videos. So not only was this cocksucker just being completely dishonest about, you know, the DMCAs that he filed against me, he was also too lazy to actually maybe even search for different videos or to even make an effort to even appear like, uh, you know, my videos were actually in violation of some sort of copyright. He just took the first four videos and said, DMCA, DMCA, first four fucking videos, that's it. That's how goddamn lazy this person is. Um, the name that these DMCAs were filed under was like, uh, Durka, Pekka, Dicka, Sucka, um, hold on, here it is. Durka, Durka Lekka, I guess is how you would say it. I'll put it here, um, but I actually know who the account, or, or whose name, whose fake name, that belongs to as far as the account. Like, uh, when the person logged on to YouTube, I know what account they were logged into. And, um, first of all, this is just what I, this is what I want to say about this whole situation that's, that's gone on with Coughlin666, um, Edible napalm is always a target for people, and, and congratulations to him because he just knows how to piss people off. I, I I wish I had this kind of talent because edible napalm is always getting fucked with, or napalm the destroyer I think is what it is now, and, and he's been DMCA'd, I believe. Um, Agnostic man seventy seven also received two DMCA's from the same asshole that DMCA'd me. Um, which is interesting because, like I said, I know exactly the account this came from. Um, and I wanted to make this video t tonight, first of all, to say something to everyone who's been watching my videos all this time. But most of all, I, I want to say something to the guy or gal or whatever you are responsible for doing what you've done here. Um, I'm petty. I I'm a very petty immature man. I, I always have been, and I'm actually less concerned with really getting my channel back than I am with, you know, like, I, I'm more concerned about finding out exactly who you are and pursuing this as far as I can. I, I'm willing to take this as far as I can with you, because I, I know what account you were signed into when you decided to file those DMCA's and really at the end of the day um, that's all I really need to know and I'm going to find out whatever it is I need to find out to take this farther and, and that's all there is to it um, you, you're not gonna hide this way I understand that you're a coward that's fine I don't have a problem with that but I'm going to pull you out from whatever fucking rock that you're hiding under and um me and you, we're going to work this out mono e bicho. That's just the way that it's going to be. And that's really all I want to say to you at this point. Um, I'm willing to go all the way. And I'm not fucking bluffing. Um, if my channel is returned to me, maybe I'll let it go. And that's a big maybe. I doubt that I will. Um... And that's it. That's for you. Um, for the rest of you who are watching this video, yeah, I'm suspended. It sucks ass and everything. And uh, we've been, we've all been through this before, especially you guys that have been around on YouTube for a long time. Um, this is my first suspension. So, and I was here for three years. Um, I said the wrong thing to the wrong guy, and he filed some DMCA's. Not really the wrong guy, just the stupid guy who was so emotional about what I said to him that he filed DMCA's against me. 
So that's cool. Um, but what I want to say to you guys is the, the people doing this, whenever you engage in this type of activity, whenever you try to silence people, this is a battle you can't win. And this is really what I wanted to say tonight. This is a, you are fighting a losing battle. You're fighting like your own little miniature war on drugs. This is a war that you cannot win. This is a war that will not end. You're, you're, you're trying to sound, you're trying to sort of silence people who are more courageous and more intelligent than you are. And um, it's just not something you can accomplish. Now, I understand if you're a coward and you don't like some of the things that these people that are better than you are saying on the internet and, and you don't have the balls or the intelligence to do what they do. I understand why you're angry. It's like, um, for the rest of you, if you've ever been playing chess with, with an opponent, I'm a chess player, so if you've ever been playing chess with an opponent that you knew was going to kick your ass here in just a couple minutes, you could see where you were going to fuck, when, where you were going to eventually lose, right? It just feels good to take his knife away from him, doesn't it? Even though you know that it, in just a few moves you're going to be in checkmate, you're going to lose the game, it still feels good to sort of take his knife and have that small victory. And that's what these people want. Um, they simply want to have their little small victories. Oh, I got Coughlin and Sarahan, or I got Sarahan suspended that one time. I got Edible Napalm suspended that one time. The small victories for the idiotic, and that's all they are. You people are simply fighting a losing motherfucking battle. I, I guess you want your small victory. I guess you know that pretty soon you're going to be in checkmate and all you can really do is take the night. Whatever it takes to make you fucking feel better, I guess. But once again, to the person who did file those DNCAs, one way or another, we will see each other again. That is all. Take it easy, guys. Peace.